We use a groundhog to predict the timing of spring, so wouldn't it make sense for us to use a caterpillar to predict the harshness of the upcoming winter? Meet the woolly bear caterpillar. You can recognize these furry little creatures by their black and orange bands. And according to folklore, the length of those bands can give us a heads up on what to expect during the winter. Or can they? Yeah, but you can see they're black on both ends, and then they've got the reddish brown in the middle. So it was thought that if it was a really long band of orange, that means it's going to be a really short and mild winter. If it's a really narrow band, it means it's going to be really severe and cold. So I don't know, according to these, it's kind of in the middle. <laughs> There is actual scientific evidence on why the woolly bear's bands differ, but it's not to help us gauge our snowfall levels. It's the opposite. It's more a reflection of how the spring and summer was than how the future is going to be, if you know what I mean. Um, because generally with most caterpillars, the longer they are, the bigger they are by the fall. That means they had really good diet, they had access to lots of food, which would probably mean it was a really good summer, really growth season, there was lots of food out there. So they just got to be big and strong. So it's more a reflection of what already happened than what's going to happen. <laughs> So the next time you see one of these furry creatures, let their different color bands help you remember the glorious days of summer and know that winter is going to happen how it will regardless. For the Weather Network, I'm Emily Vukovich.